Peace and blessings. This is Nubia I of the Blackberry Beauty Holistic Academy, Ancient African Healing for the Modern Sister. Yes, y'all, I am out on my lounge chair. I am soaking up this beautiful sun, and I'm here to remind you to keep on going. I know we are experiencing so much, but you know how we change the world by changing ourselves. And I want to remind everybody, especially during these times, to get out and get some sun. We actually need the sun. The sun is so good for us as melanated people. That's why people want to be like us, y'all. It's this amazing skin that soaks up the sun and gives us energy and power. I know a lot of my sisters also in my group, I know that they're going through it. We're going through a fast in the middle of July where people are vacationing, people are what turning it up. So you know I'm square because did I say turning it up? So y'all know what I'm talking about. People are so-called celebrating, so-called partying, you know, so-called uh, eating lots of food and barbecuing. And we chose this month to really go deep within. And so I just want to remind you all that it is okay to sit back and relax. It is okay to be in the sun and get sun. It is okay to put your bathing suit on in the middle of your courtyard or your backyard or your front yard and love what you see and allow the sun to bring forth that beautiful water and that sweating and that glistening that our, sun, that our bodies will do. We must allow ourselves to be okay with being loving and kind and nurturing to ourselves. Everyone, but particularly women, particularly sisters, we have so much to give and we give so much to others and so now it's time to give to ourselves. We have a mission and a plan. We have to keep moving forward. You know, it's interesting, y'all, today, you know, I told you all that I had the big fire. Well, we had a, well, I guess it was a small fire in our space um, yesterday. My husband and I and my daughter is also here. And so, of course, the, well, the landlady came, the, the building owner came, and her and some workers assessed it. And actually, it doesn't need sheetrocking or anything. It's just going to be a lot of scraping, priming, gawking, all these other things or caulking, <laughs> whatever you do when you when the when the when the tile is uh, separates from the tub. So it's it's not going to be bad, but it's going to still take days. But in the process, my husband and I had to take down all of our masks and move our dresses and you know move just move so much to the point that we had to pack. I mean, we live in a small loft, so. Us was packing and my husband said to me look sis, look baby he said Nubia we are moving we're not putting this stuff back so today we are moving forward we are actually uh, calling some friends to give away our plants we're doing it today everything that we're boxing most of it we're keeping in now we don't know when we're gonna move we don't know how but we know we are moving and we're doing it now and I remember, you know, I told you this a long time ago about those who want to move, those who maybe feel like I want to relocate, but I don't have the money or I want to relocate, but I'm not sure which place to go. You know, I want to relocate, but my family's here or my children's father, my children's father is still here. And I don't want to move the children from the father or any of these things that you're contemplating. The thing that I could say to you is that when you feel the need to move, it's the universe telling you, it's the universe urging you, it's the universe and your ancestors, your spirit guide pushing you and calling you to move. But if it becomes a difficult situation, what you want to do is pack. If you want to move, pack. That's what my mama told me. It's a very metaphysical uh, way of thinking and being that if you want to move, pack. You don't have to know where. You don't have to have enough money. You don't have to know what situation you're leaving behind, if it's going to be a good one or a bad one, or a situation that's coming ahead. You don't have to know any of those things. All you got to do is pack. And we decided that we are packing. That fire was there to tell us it is time to leave. I mean, isn't it ironic that preparing for them to redo the bathroom, and also the reason why we're packing our living room is because some of the fire did get, you know, in the, on the ceiling, and so and it burnt some fixtures. And so we have to move, remove so much stuff that we're, basically, like I said, we're packing. And so we're just going with it. We're not being afraid. We're moving forward. It's a blessing when spirit talks to you, but it's even more of a blessing when we listen. 
So yes, y'all, I am out in all this beautiful sun. You see that sun? I got my shea butter on. I want to remind you that I do sell beauty products. People ask me all of the time, Sister Nubia, what do you use on your skin? Well, first of all, I drink almost a gallon of water a day. Um, also, I, um, I'm eating very, very well, you know, but I'm also fasting now, especially now it's all about liquids. I had my last meal uh, to, earlier today, and that's my last meal. I'm starting my liquid fast tomorrow. Um, but it's the products. If you're going to sit out in all this beautiful sun, you want to still protect the skin. We have shea butter products. I use my black soap. I do uh, bentonite clay masks, and I love it. So I'm, I lathered all my shea butter on. What I love about shea butter, especially the mixture we have, because you're mixing shea butter and um, almond oils and coconut oils and all these other oils, so it's a shea butter blend. What I love about it is, okay, you see me now, so I'm getting the sun. The sun is, you know, evening my skin tone, which I'm loving. I want to be black all over, right? But it also, and I know it looks like it's very shiny, but when it dries, it, 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 even when it dries, because right now I'm wet, right, because I'm sweating, that shine remains, but no, no residue. No greasiness, nothing. Especially, I'm telling you, that's the secret if you want to know. It's putting the shea butter products that we sell or and the black soap that I use and the clay, right? But it's the, the, for the outside, it's the shea butter sitting in the sun, allowing my body to sweat, not moving the sweat away, just allowing it to be and, and staying in the sun for me until you can't take it. For people with lighter skin, you want to be, do it very slowly. You don't want to take too much sun in, you may burn, I mean, I'm talking about black folks here. You may burn or your body might not be used to it, but what happens is your body will, will uh, uh, create a protective uh, darkening. That tan we're talking about, is that actually allows you to sit in the sun longer. So for some, you don't want to stay out as long as I do. I've been sitting in the sun since I can remember. I, I, I almost remember, I think it was when I was 11 or 12 years old. So for over, what, I'm 40, I'll be 49 next month. So for over, what, 40 or 37 years, I've been sitting in the sun, and my body is very used to it. But I, you can sit longer when you have this beautiful protection, and we are protected by the Most High. Get your melanin on, enjoy yourself, and just allow yourself to, it's okay to love yourself. It's okay to step away from social media. It's okay to step away from all that is happening. It's okay to strengthen yourself, and it's okay to move. So as many of you know, right now I'm doing the intensive fasting one-on-one, but next month uh, the intensive is called traveling outside of your comfort zone. It's a $97 a month intensive it goes for four weeks the whole month of august and why it's so important is exactly what my husband and i are doing now that's what we're doing also you can join the group wild women who run with the womb it's a 37 dollars month membership group is going on now and for the month of july we're in the series what we're learning about studying and me doing personal videos or oh by the way for those that have been in the group wild women who run with the womb before all of the classes are totally different they're all brand new new series new everything but, of course, we're going to talk about moving outside of our comfort zone uh, more um, in the next intensive. So it's on the website now, or it's on the, it'll be on the website tomorrow, which is Monday. And I'd love for you to join, come in early. And so what we're going to talk about in there, we're going to talk about um, you wanting to move and real strategies to get you there, to help you change your mind, to get your body ready, your spirit, and just practical ways, but also spiritual ways, because we move first in our spirit. Then the rest will follow. I love you all with all my heart. I hope you are enjoying this beautiful sun. I hope you're getting sun wherever you are. And hey, thank you to my UK brothers and sisters for standing with the Black Lives Matter and standing against oppression, but also standing in love because we need so much more of it in our, in our, in our society. And I love you all with all my heart. This is Nubia I of the Blackberry Beauty Holistic Academy, Ancient African Healing for the modern sister, peace and blessings.